Hello again, everyone. This is Demand Zero Eight. Here we are again with the Timberids. It's been a while since I recorded it, so I have to remember all what we're doing. But I think we were. Yep, we're Westernizing. So in eight years we shall be done. So let's do it. Um, I'm barely making any cash. How many troops do I got? Holy crap! <laughs> I'm not used to having that many troops. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, since we are westernizing, we have to be very careful because the revolt risk is going to be high. It's going to be stupidly big, but what can you do? And that means that I can't do much either. I can't get a war because I can't... Uh, there's just no point. No, I'm going to maintain that. <laughs> I don't want Russia to be angry with me, so. And the auto derps? Oh, they still hate me. Oh. What's your mission? I could probably take the Ottomans, though, if I go look in the ledger. Oh. No, I can't. <laughs> oh god, no, I cannot. Holy crap, Russia. Spain. The auto... Oh. I have a lot of manpower, though. I got more than the next two. I need to increase my force limit soon. What are my ideas? Oh, exploration... Pretender rebels. I'll just get them with this guy, and then just have this one. You're on auto. You're on auto. You're on auto. Stop. So we're all good. I got Western units now, so. Oh, sweet. That wasn't too bad. Oh, I got a. I got a bunch of vassals. Crimea. I might, I might want to go to war in Crimea. Might be fun. <laughs> uh, no. Oh, wow, that's a crap. That's a load of crap, isn't it? Oh, it's actually really cheap. Boost up stability. France is enormous. Holy crap, France is enormous. How's, uh... <laughs> that's not going anywhere. Algiers is enormous. The new world looks interesting. I think it's kind of funny. Netherlands. Oh, they hate me. Don't hate me. I love you, Netherlands. I would love to see the Netherlands just form a bunch of, uh... Ooh. Uh-oh. Yeah, I want to see the Netherlands form a bunch of colonial regions, just because I think it's funny and awesome. Go, Netherlands. Who are your allies? You're allied with Luxembourg? That's all you got? I don't think you realize this yet, Netherlands, but you got, uh, France here. And he's... he's pretty big. Oh my god. Well, the Hans are... is not as bad as it could be, I'll say that. If you get... oh my god, Prussia... oh yeah, that's right, Prussia did form. The Teutons did it, right? Oh boy. That's... The Prussian ideas are stupidly good. Ah. Okay. What else do we got? Hmm. 
Cosmopolitan Columbia. There's still a lot that can be colonized over here in the New World. I might want to try. Except that Sunni and religious colonies tend to... Sunni and Catholic colonies tend to uh, fight each other a lot. And they won't always call in. Which is annoying, because, you know, you settle all of it and then have, like, Portugal take all your colonies' land. And then you have to fight Portugal, but you're not really fighting Portugal, you're actually really fighting Spain, because they're always allied to Portugal. Holy crap, I don't want to fight that. Austria, Spain, and Portugal at the same time. And there's Hungary. Poland's not too bad anymore, especially since they're going to be crushed by Austria here. Hmm, Serbia exists, I'm surprised. Usually, uh, they get squashed by the autos, but I guess the autos aren't really as strong as they could be. They're still strong. Go, don't give me a rock. But they're not as strong as they could be. I've seen them literally have all of North Africa and all of Arabia and down into Nubia. And then, like, seriously, Hungary. I've seen them so large it didn't even matter that they were weaker tech than Western. You should always be afraid. Uh, always be afraid of the Ottomans until you, they're completely gone. You should, especially if you like me. Even though I am quite large, I, I'm. My goal is to reach in and grab Ming. So I'm done westernizing. All right, so. Who's still left? Is any... Japan, have you begun colonizing yet or anything? Aww. In real life, Japan, they westernized rather quickly. They began colonizing and conquering. You know, Empire Japan. So Russia is rather large. They're probably going to go in and wreck all the hordes here and... Huh. I guess they didn't want to capture Crimea. That's the one problem with the whole Crimea region. Is, uh... At any moment, Russia can have, like... A, uh, a claim over all of it. They conquer it in one go. And if that happens to be you, that's a very unfortunate thing. Alright, so any other... Russia does have a lot of Lithuania. Do they have Kiev? <sighs> Pretender rebels? <laughs> and only eight? <laughs> Please kind of insulted actually okay yeah I think they have got they got Kiev holy crap they must be making it a ton of money much more than I can though I do make a lot of money oh Oh my god, I I love the Ottoman dynasty. Oh yes! Oh my goodness, yes. Sure. I guess that's a mission. Once we're done colonizing. Wait, I got a second colonist, right? Yes, I do. Oh, look at that. I do have a second colonist. That's done. Go on the boat. Uh, absolutely, Algiers. I'll definitely go. Now I got an ally in Algiers. Are they westernizing yet? 
They need to westernize, man. It's bad when they don't westernize. These are usually some of the most aggressive natives out there, but I guess we're good. Yeah, I, I want all of Indonesia, Indochina, and China. I feel like once I've gathered all these provinces, I'll be very, very rich. And there's a lot of Chinese out there. They'll be great recruits into my man, my manpower, my armies. Ooh. Like I care about Vagina Gar's opinion on me. <laughs> they already hate me. Uh, there are only three provinces, right? Only 14,000 troops left. I mean, what else could they possibly. Oh, England's already doing. Good luck. Ooh. Hmm. Let's do morale. Still, losing points is never a good thing. Whose bank is quite large? New World always generates oddly. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but every time the New World generates, it always seems like they have a problem. Like, the AI has a problem colonizing it. Oh well, they'll get used to it, I guess. Alright. Uh, I'm not gonna form an alliance of Brunei. They are very, very weak. No, they're not worth it. Unless they westernized off me. They're still... These guys are still Chinese tech. I actually hope they don't westernize off me. That'd be a problem. Ah, oh, stability. I love the stability. I'm a lover of stability. Okay. At Coinlu... There's still one province miners. Have you been curting? I don't know how these AIs able to keep it all together. Oh, but I guess they figure it out somehow. Oh, the Byzantines don't have a core on this anymore. Okay, is Lan Na ready? Or Long Zeng? Uh, I'll just send you a gift. And then I'll integrate you. Uh, westernization. It's always a hassle. There. There we are. Time to annex. Shop is... Oh, crap. Come on. I don't want to lose 50 ducats. Screw it. It's one prestige. Not like anyone's going to go to war against me because I lost one prestige. Ooh, nice. Uh, going to war against me is... Oh, no! Russia, I don't think you should be doing that. Like, at all. Because that's my territory. 
Shouldn't you be concreting the Urals and say, oh, okay, good. They have. I never like it uh, when they get closer and closer to reforming the Holy Roman Empire. Because you know it's closer and closer to having basically an unstoppable force in the middle of Europe. Look at that, Frankfurt exists. Only 93 units have died in that. Oh, Prussia, what happened? Oh, wait, did you gain a unit? Oh, crap, they did. They got another province. Well, it's a good thing that it's not necessary. Administrative. I'll be fine military wise at least. Oh, we're so close. On oh, more year. Civil war in the Congo, that's topical. Maybe I shouldn't say that. Yeah. Did they convert it? Yep, they did. In case you weren't aware, uh, the Congo, the Democratic Republic of the Congo, just went and had a super severe civil war. It kind of went into the draw. You should probably go look it up. It, it's comparable to World War II. That's how bad it was. In case uh, you are interested and know what I'm talking about. Oh! Yeah! Westernized! Okay. Turning the tide. What? Oh. Okay. I didn't know I was doing that. Okay. Um... Flintlocks. Absolutely. Uh... More ships. All my troops. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I hate that so much sometimes. If there weren't so many pop so much population here, I just kill all all of, the, all of the natives here, but there is a lot of population. Okay. I got a lot of troops. And I would love to go to war with Ming, but let's go go after Sean. Sean's a good target. Let's go back from the autos. The autos are probably the least likely to declare war on us. Okay. And I guess Russia. Oh, Ming probably just lost a horrible war to Russia. Yeah, where's Ming? Holy crap. Did they lose that badly? Nope, there they are. Only 56,000. I can declare war on you, alright? Hmm. Maybe what the colonialism CB. If everybody claim on, I guess, Tungu, I already pronounced that. So, Indochina, I definitely want Indochina. There are, 
some very, very valuable provinces down here. Look at that, 11. Not even like it's center trade, too. Seven, you know. Eleven here. That is an important center trade. I want to get trade ideas as well. I feel like we should. Oh, important center trade here. China has so many. Oh, I need to take that from Spain. No way Spain can fight me. Not at the level I'm at right now. Wow, look at that. That's horrible. They lost badly, didn't they? They had to release Northumberland. Oh, my goodness. And Scotland exists. And they're allied with Sweden. Oh no! What what religion are you guys? Oh, Protestant. Cool. All right. Let's do this. Maybe I should take in the colonialism final idea so I can have that CB against them. Hmm. They're only allied with Urai Horde and Sakutai. Sakutai? I don't know. I'm not scared of the Urai Horde in any way. But I am scared of Russia, so. Russia is probably going to go conquer all of the hordes right now. I am very scared of them. I got all Tibet. Except for, uh, pretty much all of India is mine. Except for a little tiny. What? What happened? Oh, it's still arriving. Okay, come on, Bone. We got to finish. Bone has fish. That's unfortunate. I guess it could be worse. Okay. Oh yeah, I'll definitely raise base tax higher, especially if it's two. Where's Bidar? Yeah. That Bidar? Yep, that's up to five. Yep. What's my next idea? Group 14. Yeah. I wish I could stop being Defender of the Faith, but I have to. Still working on that? Crap! Ugh. Alright. I bet you're ready for this, Ming. Oh. How cool it for a bit. Joe still has a bunch of cores on everything here, so... How long does it last? Declare war. Um... Sure? Holy crap, that's bad. I've seen some pretty bad leaders, but a one, a zero one. Oh my goodness, that is bad. All right. Okay. 
fine, I don't care. One, two, three. Oh, you gotta chill. Yep. And that was the end of that. One, two, three. What? Seven land morale, holy crap. That's pretty good. Oh no! Yeah, fighting East Asians, it's not like fighting uh, Sub-Saharans or Native Americans, but it's still very easy if you're a Western. It, it's like a walk in the park. I mean, you'll dominate Indian tech, which is why I changed to Western. But it's going to be a bit more difficult. You still need a good amount of troops before you take on. Like, my, my set. Like, if they sent in 100,000 troops, I could probably handle it. So long as it was divided up and I could conquer. It would take all, almost all of my effort, but I'd probably handle it if I was Indian tech, but... Ming with their 100,000 Chinese tech, it's pretty good. 100,000 Chinese tech units, but... It's... Definitely... Not like, uh, my tech. Oh, do I not have... No, I don't have holy colonialism on them. want to go invade it in China. Suka thai. Oh, what did I do? Now I don't have any diplomatic power. Look what I did. I'm an idiot. Ah, oh well. Army organizer, absolutely. I'm kind of scared to take military ideas right now because I'm still very behind. So I'll probably wait until I'm ahead in military to start doing military ideas. Because the last thing you ever want to be is behind in Western in military tech. Now I've got a lot of troops and I could probably handle it a little bit. But being behind in military tech is one of the worst things in this game. Especially when you got France and Spain to deal with. Portugal is not such a problem. The only problem is that they're allied to Spain. That's their one issue. Oh, I'll take one more base tax. I need to go and invade a uh, Makassar here. They got no allies, but they. Sir, would you like... Oh. I could make them a protectorate, but... What are you doing? Attack! This is really annoying. I, I noticed this as well one time I, when my Mali Iron Man is that sometimes your vassals or colonial nations underneath you will just st stand there and won't attack. It's really annoying. So, uh, He is... Oh! Oh, it's a Mughal Protectorate. I don't want it to Protectorate. So, I'll take... Let's see, what's the most valuable provinces? One, two... Six to Anko. Two, three. And again, I gotta. 
I think it went too long ago, though. Huh, but I do want that border with Ming. Okay, let's go see what we can do. One, two, three, four. Five. Okay. Send them in. Jizia. Now I got some overextension probably by now. 85%, that's a lot. But. I'll be fine. Oh. Do I, do I have colonialism on you yet? No, I do not. I should, but I do not. I don't care too much about admin points. Hmm. Oh, Divia. Oh. They're all in one little coalition against. That's so cute. Oh. Look at them. <laughs> oh, they really think that they have a shot against me, don't they? You. Oh, he's even worse. You're gone. I don't need you. It still is adorable, it really is. Yep, sending in the troops. We're gonna invade Ming. I'm gonna do good. Oh, <laughs> uh, the Mughalese Empire. One of my favorites. I just love the name and the color. Just Mughals. The flag, too. Just look at that flag. It's beautiful. It's a rich. It, it's not like Brunei. Look at that. It's just a yellow flag. Brunei. There's no creativity at all. Do Portugal, you know. It's kind of the same as all the other flags in Europe as well. This is, this is interesting, but, you know. That's not cool either. I mean, some of these are alright, but the Ming, I especially don't like either. And look at Oman. It's also a red flag. It's just a red flag. I mean... I, I like the Mughal's flag the best. I mean, I like these colors, but it's not that creative. This is interesting as well, but... Alright, I think that's been enough for this episode, people. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you guys next time with the Conquest of Ming.